Hello, in this Visual Basic video, I am going to run you through the array list collection. So, a collection and an array list, and more specifically, a collection is just a special way of storing data. It's very specialized because it allows you to retrieve data in a slightly different way compared to a regular array or a regular, let's say, variable. And the actual sort of you know resizing and the indexing is slightly different. There's a bunch of different collections, and I'll cover all of them. So this is cool because it allows you to you know insert and remove items from the array list at a specified location using index, and the array will actually resize itself. So it's pretty dynamic and really really cool. So to create an array list, you just do dim in the right location first the dim our list as array list and you do equals new array list so the reason we're doing new array list like so because this is actually an object of a class so just take you for granted for now because later on in this series you will be learning about classes and how to create them and you'll become a lot more familiar just for now just think of it this is the way you create an array list once you've you know done this part everything else should be pretty much the same so to add data to the array list you just do the name of the array list so our list dot add so if i add uh, number 90 then i'll do our list dot add another number and i'll just do one more just to keep it simple i won't add a ridiculous amount we can add as many as we want say for uh, 56 and now what we can do is do a couple of cool things so we could do console dot right line and we can actually get the length of it by doing our list dot count so if you run it it'll print out three so there are three values so that's what this is specifying so that's you know pretty cool we can also loop over every single item in the array list using you know the for each array so for each and i'm going to do dim you know i'm going to put dim val as integer because all of the values in the array list are integers so for each val in the array list we're just going to do console dot right line and if you print out val run it as you can see it's printer 93 and 56 so those are all of the values so that is all really really cool and there's like so many other no function you know pieces of functionality that you can use so if you just do our list dot so you can clear it you can check if it contains something you can even you know insert stuff like if you you can insert specify index and you insert it at a particular location really really cool stuff you can remove it as well as an extra task i want you to leverage some of these methods i will provide a link so you can check all of the different pieces of functionality out. Feel free to contact me if you have any questions. And I'll look forward to seeing you in the next programming video.